Aloha, everyone. Connections Hawaii State Resource Directory is an app that we need your help in creating. This app will be used by state employees who, while assisting the public, can gain quick access to information outside of their departments. I think we've all experienced trying to get information from the state, and we keep getting referred from one department to another. This app would allow for one call, one visit. As First Lady, I recognize the frustration the public experiences. I also know that our state employees want to provide the best services they can. Next slide. So we created a cross-sector collaborative that includes the Public Safety Department, Executive Office of Early Learning, Department of Health, Department of Human Services, and the Department of Education. We all came together because we recognize the critical need to communicate across government agencies, especially in this time of the COVID pandemic. But we need you. If you can help us develop the Connections app, you will be helping our most vulnerable citizens and therefore making it easier for our community to find the services they need to move forward in this time and to thrive. Next slide. The problem. We are disconnected. As the First Lady indicated, we as state employees want to provide the best services we can. Currently, there is no state directory or app of programs and services that the state employees can use to help the public make this connection. Oftentimes, state employees only know the programs or services in their own department. They may or may not know about other department programs. And sometimes you need to be eligible for one program to receive benefits in another program. It's complicated. We're frustrated too, and at times feel very inadequate, and sometimes just as disconnected as the public. Next slide. When we're disconnected, families may not get all the help they need. As of September, Hawaii has an unemployment rate of 15% and a 380% change. Did you get that? 380% change in unemployment between January and September of this year. If you're unemployed, what do you need? You need money. You need money to buy, pay your rent or mortgage, to buy food, to get health care insurance. You may also need help paying your electricity bill and possibly health child care. What about money to buy computers or mobile devices and internet connection for your school-aged children to participate in distance learning or telehealth appointments for Kapuna? Benefits and services are available, but the question is, how can you get a coordinated connection rather than a disconnection? You can solve this problem by creating an app for us. Disconnection isn't anyone's fault or lack of willingness of state employees to help. Due to various types of funding sources, government funded benefits and services stream down from the federal, state, city or county levels and it gets siloed into specific departments or offices. Help us make the connection so families can get all the help they need. Next slide, please. No matter how diverse our agencies appear, we share a common thread. Our programs and services impact the same customers. From Keiki to Kapuna, prenatal to end of life, we help families and individuals connect to the services. So how do we do this? Some may say mm, not very well. Next slide. Connections, our state resource directory app, will cater to assist state agencies by automating a direct connection from one agency services in, to another in just a few clicks. The app shall require key responses in order to match the customer's needs to the much, need, much needed benefits. We do our best when we are able to connect our customers to the program and services, enabling them a sense of self-sufficiency. A family, under the Department of Human Services may be eligible for food assistance via the SNAP program. 
And because they are recipients of SNAP benefits, on the Department of Education, their keiki may be eligible for the free lunch program. But how will they know this? The Connections app is to the rescue. The app shall return on how to apply for SNAP benefits and additionally how to apply for school free lunch program. The Connections app will quickly link the state employee and the customer service, I'm sorry, and the customer to services offered by two different departments, the Department of Human Services and the Department of Ed Education. How awesome is that? One stop shop, go Connections. Next slide, please. The Connections app is a way to eliminate the guesswork and frustrations of handoffs, delays, and government red tape. Connecting our customers to their needs is so rewarding. And we look forward to the day when data reveals how the Connections app has improved our delivery of customer service and positive impact on the livelihood of the people we have served. Next slide, please. So let me share a fictional and yet typical story of Michelle, the government, aid, um, government employees here on a regular basis. Michelle and Jason are married with three children who are four years old, 12 years old, and 17 years old. They live in Michelle's parents' house. Michelle's mother has Alzheimer's and needs 24 seven care. Michelle's father was taking care of the mother, but he can no longer care for her due to his own medical issues. Michelle quit her job to take care of her parents. So Jason is the sole breadwinner. He works for the city and county of Honolulu. Through his work, the family has the healthcare coverage. The oldest child is going to college and relying on one source of income is difficult to make the ends meet even without the need to pay for rent. Michelle is considering going back to work and began job search. She's also looking for a caretaker to look after her parents and childcare for her four-year-old when she starts to work. Michelle didn't know where to start, so she calls Executive Office on Early Learning and DHS for help. Just like Michelle, Families and individuals often come to us for one program and don't know what else might be available. Each agency can assist her with a program it administers. Warm handoffs to other agency programs do not happen often in order to connect Michelle with. What if we can change that with a one-stop solution app? The government agencies can avoid adding more stress on the residents who are already under tremendous stress and retelling the same story to each application process to be re-traumatized. Without this one-stop resource app for our own use, we will continue to be disconnected from one another and to have a negative impact on the health and well-being of our residents as they will need to wait longer and leaving the state for the perceived better opportunities and lower cost of living elsewhere. Given the current economic crisis created by the pandemic, the future of the state and federal government programs are at risk due to the decrease in tax revenues, while business closures, unemployment, and applications to government benefits continue to increase. The federal and state funds are already limited. It affects us all as a family member, a taxpayer, and a business partner. How soon can we get this app developed? We need you and your innovation now. Mahalo, and turn this back to Mark. 